Okay, now let's move right on into our business. Um, I have a statement here that, I, that I'd like to, to read. Ladies and gentlemen, commissioners and staff, welcome to the February 2012 public hearing meeting of the Greater Lowndes County Planning Commission. I now call this meeting door. As, may, as most of you may be aware, the Planning Commission serves as an advisory body to local member governments regarding land use requests. The determinations made here tonight will be forwarded to the applicable local governments as recommendations. We are a recommending body only. Final determination regarding tonight's request will be made by the appropriate local governments at their respective meetings. Even if the Planning Commission recommends denial or tabling of an item, it will still go to the local government for final decision. All interested persons should attend the local government's public hearing regarding these requests. All of the cases we'll review, that we will review tonight are listed on an agenda which is available on the podium located at the back of the room where you entered. If you did not pick up a copy when you entered, you may do so now. Also available on the podium are handouts which outline the ground rules under which this meeting will be conducted. The, hand, the handouts also include standards for conducting public hearings. During the meeting, I will call each request in the order that they appear on the agenda. Staff will then present their report regarding the request and give their recommendations. The commissioners may have discussion with staff at that time. I will next call for those wishing to speak in favor of the request and then for those wishing to speak against the request. If you wish to speak in regards to a request, Please come forward at the appropriate time, state your name and address, and then give your presentation. Fairness and equity to both sides is our goal. State law requires that we allow 10 minutes to each side of an issue. In the interest of time, we ask that you keep your comments brief so that all who wish to speak may have time to be heard. We also ask that information given by a prior speaker not be repeated. If you choose to speak regarding an application, Please direct all comments to the Planning Commission Board only. Do not direct comments to staff, to applicants, or to those in the audience. Do not turn toward the audience or solicit debate from others. Please keep all <coughs> comments proper, polite, and to the point. Once public participation is closed, all further discussion of an application is reserved to the Planning Commission. The handouts previously mentioned also include a copy of our standards for the exercise of zoning powers, which are the guidelines we use for determining whether or not a request is consistent with the comprehensive plan. These standards are significant factors we use in making our decisions and final recommendations. <coughs> the handouts also include a copy of Georgia's conflict of interest in zoning Law guidelines, all planning commission members will be asked to excuse themselves from acting on any matter in which they have a conflict file. Final action on tonight's application will be held as follows. Let's see. The transfer <clears throat> case will be Monday, March the 5th at 6 p.m. The Lowndes County cases will be Tuesday, March the 13th at 5.30 p.m. City of Aldosta cases. They will be heard by the City of Aldosta on Thursday, March the 8th at 5.30 p.m. at the City Hall Chamber. We appreciate your attention to these housekeeping issues and again welcome you to our meeting.